Hi there, this is Brian Merovich, and I'm going to show you how to create a text link that, when clicked, will take your visitor anywhere on the page that you want. So in this example, I created this text link. When I click it, it takes me down to this area of the page where a visitor can upload an image, up to four actually, and, and write about it, which creates user-generated content, which is great for me, so I don't have to write it all the time. Um, <clears throat> And by the way, this is a plugin I created, and you can go check it out, uh, the video on my YouTube channel or at my website, brianmerovich.com. Okay, so um, you don't have to use it for that. You can use it for anything in terms of uh, directing them to any part of the page that you want. So here's how you do that. So we're going to link down. So if I want to link down, I have to create this bit of code exactly as it is in front of any text I want. In this example, I'm using this text. Click here to go to the bottom of the page, and then I'm going to close it. Very important with this. Okay, so if I copy this, and then put this, well, let me explain it first. Now, <clears throat> this code here, the pound sign in front of this phrase, this pound sign here, is telling this link to look for the, this phrase somewhere on the page. Okay, so I'm going to put this in front of whatever text I want. So in this case, I'm just going to put bottom of the page or post. So I'm just going to go all the way to the bottom. I'm going to click, and we're in text mode, by the way. You can't put code in visual, so we're in text mode. I'm going to click Preview Changes. So here's the link I just created. If I click that, I'm taken all the way to the bottom. See, here's the text. And you can't see the code, of course, because it's the actual page. All right. <clears throat> so let me do the opposite of that. If you want to click from the bottom of the page to the top, you would put this code wherever you want at the bottom. This is the reverse of what we just did. So again, this pound sign is telling this link to look for this phrase. So this will go at the top. So at the bottom, we're putting this. Let me just, I'll just delete this to make it. At the top, we'll put this code with any text you want again, okay? Did I copy that? Let's see. Okay. I'll just delete that one. Paste. I'm going to click Preview Changes, and if I go to the bottom of the page, here's the link I just created. Click here to go to the top of the page. Boom, I'm all to the top. And here's the text. Again, you can't see the code because it's code. Okay, now if I want to do this with an image, let's say I want to click somewhere at the Anywhere I want, I'm just going to do this as a simple example. Let's say I have an image that says, in this case, it's just going to say link down. So I will add that image, add media. I already uploaded it, so I'm just going to click that. I'm going to go to link to custom URL. And I'm going to copy just this part, not the quotations, and put it here. Click insert into post. Okay, so it's going to go right there. This is you can do this in visual or text and with the image only. Since we're still in text, this or yeah, we're going to go to the bottom. Okay. Now I will put this code again. I'm going to copy this at the bottom. Okay. So now if I click preview changes. Here's my new image linked down. Again, that code is telling the clickable image to look for that code, which is in front of this text. Okay? This pound sign is telling this link to look for this phrase, which I just put at the bottom of the page. Okay? And then if you want to link from the bottom to the top with an image, you just do the reverse as I just showed you with the text. So hopefully that helps you out. If it did or didn't, or you need more clarification, please let me know by commenting here on this YouTube video, or you can go to my website where I'll link to a page where I 
put this all in text, including the code, so you can just copy and paste it. All right, I'll be signing off. Thank you.